everybody, this is Captain Creeper, and welcome to a little video on a thing I'm going to call the zoo. So this is a series that is going to be connected to my wacky world, where I go uh, into a little cage, and I look at an animal, and I learn about it, and then I will um, basically go and add it into my zoo and my world. Um, and today we are looking at one of the newest additions to Minecraft. Oh, whoops, my mic's far away from my face. Sorry about that the um, blah, 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 parrot and I grabbed some seeds because these are what you use to tame them so we have one here the others seem to have escaped uh, but this guy's still in here he's, he's a prime specimen um, now they come in many different colors such as here, let me let me head out and show you some of the other colors uh, we have a green one here there's a blue one there are also white and dark blue I believe there's one swimming. Yeah, there's a dark blue over here. Um, and white as well. Um, a lot of reds. I don't see any whites. Uh, but yeah, these guys spawn in jungle biomes, I believe. Um, and they like seeds. Now, I'm not sure which seeds they like. Let's, let's choose one. Let's choose a random one out here rather than the ones in here. Let's, uh, does this work? Mm, that works. Do they like normal seeds? Yes. Do they like cocoa beans? No. And they like pumpkin seeds. This guy's gonna be... Alright, so once you have tamed one, they will follow you around like any other animal, but they will fly. Also, if they land, oh, also if they fly into you, they will hop on your shoulder like a regular pirate parrot. Uh, if you jump up something, like, where's a block that I can jump up? Like this chest? You can see that they will not fall off, but if I drop down, they will fall off. Um, and that's how you get them off your back. And if you right-click, they will sit down, just like any other bird. I actually have three others that I might go ahead and put in the cage uh, along with this guy. So let's, let's head in here. I believe they teleport like any other animal. So they just like jungle biomes, so I created them this nice area. Oh, there's a little hiding guy here. Oh, and another one. Wow, okay then. I'm going to sit you down in here. You. I am also going to sit down. Um, so their main survival tactic is hiding in the grass. That is what they mainly do. Hiding in grass and leaves. That's this guy can stay with me. That is their main defense when it comes to enemies. Uh, but they don't have many enemies when they grab the sword. And down here is their main friend. See, as you guys can see, there's guy there's guy chilling out here. Now, zombie horses can sometimes be thought of as bad guys, but to the parrots, they are extremely good friends. They parrots love these guys. They're they're amazing. And I am not sure how the parrots swam their way out of here, but this is how they escaped. They use a pressure plate to get in there, and then they swam up over here. So they are tricky little creatures. And, uh, yeah, they're very cool, and they will be added to my zoo uh, quite soon. So um, when you when you look at this, when you look at this pair, the designs are really cool. They're besides bats, the only flying mob in um, in Minecraft. They are the only bird in Minecraft as well, which is super amazing. Um, I might I want to talk a little bit about the enclosure here. We got some water, um, the jungle stuff. This is some perfect brush for hiding in, as you guys saw. The green ones. What are you doing out there? Camouflage in extremely well. And, um, like this guy. When they're down in that hole... Here, let me grab... Let me take this guy. He's gonna come over with me. When they get in little holes in the brush, they're nearly impossible to see. As you guys can see with this one. The other ones are more colorful. I'm not sure why. Probably because they're idiots. Okay. As you can see, they're very hard to see through the brush. This guy has no idea what's going on. Um, there are also, if I... Real quick. Allow cheats. Alright, well, that's... Oh, my chat's off. That's why. Uh, that is controls. Uh, chat. Alright. So, if you... I'm, I'm gonna set this to night. This way, right, right. That's not how you spell night, is it? I am sorry. I, I apologize for my own stupidity. Alright, so when it is night, this place is very beautifully lit by 
glowstone in the trees so that it is never dark for these pets because dark is very scary for them. So as you guys know, they are very tricky. They're also um, very fun birds to play with. They're, they're amazing little birds. Like this dude. Hop, hop on my shoulder. And they're the perfect pal. They are an amazing pet. <laughs> that, that guy has no idea what's going on here. He's confused. This guy wanted a little drink of water and to swim with the squids. They're very friendly, very tricky. Uh, and yeah, that's the parrot. So I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all later. Bye! Oh, sorry, bird. Bye!